New at six tonight, it appears a very visual change is on the way for the taxi cab industry in the district. DC officials are planning to streamline the colors of these vehicles, and as DC Bureau Chief Sam Ford reports, this is part of a bigger plan to help riders. They grabbed the attention of passers-by outside the Verizon Center today. Prototypes of possible color schemes for DC cabs. The sign said, vote for your favorite color. You're gonna I'm vote. ready to vote. Okay, well, do you know, do you like this one? Do you like the red ones? I like the one with the red bottom and the white top. She liked this one. A cab driver liked this one. What is that? You like the green one better? Oh, yeah, it's beautiful, man. <laughs> and it stands out like New York cab or something. You know, you see that. It can't be nothing but a cab. And in a news conference to show off the new colors, the mayor says he likes red to match the metro buses, but... Just a part of the process like everybody else. We really want to hear from the public. Since the council mandated that all cabs look alike and have smart meters that read credit cards, a lawsuit has delayed the smart meters, but the Taxi Cab Commission's moving ahead with the colors. Estimated cost, 1000 to 1500 per vehicle. Who pays? The taxi owner. This isn't going to happen overnight. They're going to do it through attrition. As new cabs come online, they will have to have the new color scheme starting next summer, perhaps like this one. As new vehicles join the fleet. So instead of painting it the colors you want it, you're going to paint it the colors that the city says you have to pay it. There's no difference in the cost. We found a lot of people quite indifferent. I don't care what my cab looks like as long as it gets me where I want to go. If it has nothing else to do, they have to do this. These four cabs will be on display here until next month, then to Union Station during the inaugural, then to the car show. There are other color schemes online at dctaxi.dc.gov where you can also vote for your favorite. In Northwest Washington, Sam Ford, ABC 7 News.